Okay, this is fifth grade, lesson one, and the first lesson is on sequences and digits, okay? Now, sequences, do you happen to know what a sequence is? No? Okay, a sequence is a list of numbers in order. So, for example, this is a sequence. What's happening each time I go to the next number? It's adding up. It's adding up. Excellent. Okay, you're exactly right. All right, let's try this one. What's happening? By twos. Going up by twos. Excellent. You're exactly right. Okay, so that's a sequence. It's keeping the same sequence the whole way through. Okay, so the, the second one we did kept going two, 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 two every time. All right, try this one. By fives. Okay, what will be the next number? 25. Very good. Excellent. Okay, so those are sequences, okay? And um, if I was to ask you what's the rule for that one, you would tell me plus five. Because each time it's going plus five. You got it? All right, so each, anytime we have an ordered list of, of numbers and it keeps a sequence, okay, each number is called a term. It's not real important to know, but just kind of get it in your head, all right? Here's an, um, one of the problems you're going to have. And then it's going to go boom, boom, boom. First of all, tell me what the rule for this is. Okay, what's happening each time? By threes. By threes. Okay, so it's going plus three, plus three more, plus three more, plus three more. So what's the next one going to be? Fifteen. Excellent. And the next one? Eighteen. Very good. And the next one? Twenty-two. Almost. Twenty-one. So you get it? Mm -hmm. Feel like you understand it? Okay, so these are sequences and the rule that it's doing is plus three. You got it? All right, now, this one's gonna be a little bit more difficult, okay? So it's got a little bit harder, all right? But I want you to pay attention. It's bigger numbers. You may have to think through this one for a minute. Okay? Think about it. I'm going to let you look at it for a minute and tell me what you think. Six. Almost. Try again. Think, Seven. Keep thinking. Seven. Every time, what's it doing? But well, we're going in this direction, so what's it doing? Going down. Down seven. Minus seven. Minus seven, okay? Now, try to figure out what my next one's gonna be. You can even work it on your paper if you need to. 42 minus seven. Mm -hmm. 42 minus seven, try that. And you can tell me what the next one's going to be. So you figured out the rule, negative minus 7. Very good. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Remember, you look over here. 7. Can you take away 7 from 2? You take away seven apples from two apples. No. No, so what do you do? You borrow, remember? Ten plus that would be twelve. Remember this? It's been a while. We're kind of both rugged from the from uh summer. Okay, so then you go seven into the, from that. Yes. He's almost got it. Uh -huh. So what is it going to be? 7 to 3 would be... Oh, okay. it can't do that, so it has to borrow from what? Nope. Okay, 
All right, to finish up that one, let's go on. And what did you think it was, Eli? What was your answer? 35. 35, you're exactly right. Okay, and if I was to go to the next one, what would I do? What would my rule be? What am I doing each time? Taking away seven. Taking away seven. So that's all we would need to do to figure that one out, okay? You feel like you understand? Mm -hmm. This one will be 28, just to let you know, okay? All right, good job. So those are called sequences, and each of those numbers is called the term. All right, now let's talk about digits, okay? And all a digit is is a number. So this is a digit. Those are, have two digits. This one has three digits. This one has four digits. This one has five digits. See how it works, okay? So each number is a digit, all right? Let me write down a number, and I want you to tell me how many digits it has in it. How many digits does that number have? Six. Very good. Excellent. Six. It has six digits, okay? Now, if I asked you, what is the last digit in this number? What would you tell me? Eight. Very good. You're exactly right. Okay. Good job. All right. That is lesson one.